circumstances in which the young people involved learn about their rights and very consistently we found in all the ones that we've held that that's what the kids say they've not had enough education about their rights they've had not enough access to information or, and so on so the idea is that, that um, uh, they need and they want more opportunity to explore what it is to be a human being with rights. Well, I started taking the movers because I thought it really was important that we made some kind of way in which we could organize the ideas of young people and present them to some people who ought to hear them. And there are a lot of what you might call sort of one-off events in which kids are involved just as, you know, their token events. And uh, I remembered that uh, when I was, um, went to the World Summit for Children, which was in 1990, uh, at that time the, the um, kids that were re represented just as tokens. So there was a document that was published it was a document that was, came out of that was an agenda for action, and the role of the kids was to hand the pen to their government representative. Well, I, I think it's a question of hope, you know. It's, it's a question of thinking. Nothing happens unless you think about it and do something about it. If you let things happen, they will probably go the wrong way. So you've got to, the Chase the Movers allows you to really come to grips with some of the issues and then think yourself, think them through and figure out what to do with it. 